What's up guys, thanks for tuning in to another video. Today we're gonna go ahead and install uh, the CD bracket either for a light or a antenna for the 100 series Land Cruiser and it goes right here. So big shout outs to Mike. Uh, I'll put his Instagram below uh, to make sure to follow him. He uh, hooked it up with this bracket here. Uh, so yeah, good looking out Mike, I appreciate you. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and install <laughs> this CD bracket. Not sure what if I'm gonna, gonna not sure what I'm going to go ahead and mount on here just yet, but I, I thought it would be a, a good video to show you guys how to install this bracket. And then whatever you decide to mount on here, then that would be up to you. Either a backup light, a chase light, or an antenna like I mentioned, or I mean who knows, right? Bottle opener. Uh, but yeah, let's, uh, let's go ahead and then show you how to install this. And before I do that, because I didn't have a torque bit set, I went ahead and ordered one from Amazon, so if you want to pick one of these up, you could pick it up on the description below. Um, you will be buying it off my Amazon store, so I will uh, <coughs> obviously benefit from it, So, but you'll be supporting as well this channel. So yeah, it's a, it's a pretty good set. I think it was right under uh, 20 bucks. It got T30 all the way up to T60, and if I'm not wrong, I think we're gonna use a T40 for, uh, for this bracket here. So if you wanna pick this up, uh, click on the description below uh, pick up a nice set. It's always good to have um, and what I like about it They're not loose. So if you want to go ahead and throw that in your toolbox or in your uh, tool bin for uh, overlanding or camping uh, You can just go ahead and do that. So uh, let's go ahead and start uh, installing this bracket So I believe it's a t40 um, if Here's what the Tark bit looks like t40 Perfect, so now we're gonna get our ratchet to unratch this. This one was fairly easy to remove. And so was this. And for this uh, particular application, you don't need to remove the whole bracket. Uh, for this application, you don't have to remove the whole bracket. You can actually just slide it in. If you want to go ahead and take it completely off, you could, or you could just leave it on. And then what you could just do is, so just get it loose enough where you could slide it right in, just like that. As you guys can see, there's a lot of dust in there. Slide it right in to contour the body. Then we're gonna go ahead and obviously switch the ratchet side. We're gonna go ahead and hand tighten it first. And because it wasn't too um, too uh, too torque or too uh, tight, we're just gonna go ahead and tighten it. Just like that. We're gonna go ahead and close the tailgate and the hatch to make sure we clear. Go slow. And that's pretty close to the light. So make sure you close it slowly uh, before you slam it. This might be able to bend a little bit this way. Um, there is a little small gap, so maybe you want, might wanna bend it before you install it. But as you guys can see, that's pretty like, Pretty close. I don't think we'll damage it, but we might want to bend it a little bit. So make sure you, uh, you go slow before you slam this closed. So now we're going to close the hatch. Obviously no issues with the hatch, but there you have it. So after looking at it, you can't, I mean, you could probably bend it a little bit, but not too much because the bracket actually sits up against the tail light. So you can't bend it too much because it's either you're going to crack or uh or damage your tail light on this side but as you can see no issues but if you've been in if but if your land cruiser has been in an accident or any kind of collision that might be an issue so before you go ahead and slam the tailgate uh again make sure you go slow and see if uh if it clears but that's pretty much it so uh what we're gonna mount on here don't know yet um possibly an antenna um or even a whip once we go into the desert so um, this is pretty easy. I don't have to have it on all the time. 
it probably takes like what a couple minutes five minutes to install it probably took me longer to film this video but it's um i don't have to have it on here all the time so it's easier to take off and on um so i think mainly i think i'm going to use it for is probably either uh uh, radio uh, antenna or if not I'm probably just gonna use it for a whip uh, if we go into the desert and try to put this uh, Land Cruiser in the dunes so hope you guys enjoyed this video of the CD bracket install uh, again big shout outs to Mike uh, make sure to go check him out and follow his YouTube channel as well uh, his YouTube channel and Instagram are in the description below go ahead and support uh, big shout outs to him and thanks for watching catch you guys on the next video and subscribe